Hi guys, before this video starts, I just want to tell you that this video concludes a Discord API. So, and Discord API is so strict, more strict than your parents maybe. But, um, uh, what this API does is it can send like 2,000 messages a day. But if your game gets played like jailbreak, like player, player comes in, player leaves, then you're going to abuse Discord. And if you abuse Discord, uh, your Discord account will be permanently banned. It will be terminated. So I just wanted to say that to keep you guys safe. So if your account got banned due it to this reason of my tutorial, it's not my responsibility um, because uh, I just gave you a warning. And in the in the tutorial, I'll say once again. Uh, so it's just so you know what's going up in the tutorial. And I just want to keep you guys safe with your Discord account. So um, enjoy the video. Hey guys, and welcome back to this video. In this video, we're going to be making something with, um, with the Discord API. Uh, I'm gonna suggest you not doing this because this is quite hard and this can get your Discord account banned. So if your Discord Discord account gets banned, it's n sadly not my responsibility because I just make the tutorials and uh, I just warned you guys. So um, don't complain at me if I got your Discord account banned because I don't do that stuff. You wanna go to Discord and you wanna go to your server settings. You wanna go to integrations. You wanna go to webhooks and you wanna make a new webhook and. Copy the webhook URL, and that's everything basically. I'm gonna go into script, and then uh, that's not true. Local HTTP service is game colon get service HTTP service, and what this service is, it's like HTTP servers. You can like put Roblox to Discord and Discord to Roblox. I th I think so. It's just an epic way. Local URL. This is the your Discord URL. Uh, again, the player, the player add a colon connect function. Player, if you're new, make sure to subscribe to the channel because today or tomorrow I will be uploading part 22. Hopefully including uh, handcuffs, but no promises. Um, so if you enjoy my channel, just subscribe. And now you want to type local data is equals to this thing. Embeds. Title, uh, our title will be uh, player.name, comma, descript description, has joined your game. And now you want to type local um, data completed. It's equals to HTTP service colon JSON encode, not decode, because decode is something else. Uh, like this won't work. So when you actually use G JSON encode, and JSON is like, like, like for Discord and stuff, so it's really good. So, yeah. You want to type data, and now you want to type HTTP service colon post async URL. And data completed. So what this will do is it's gonna render your Discord, um, your Discord API webhook. Then we're gonna put the player in the game, and then we're gonna make some data. So like how the player joins and all that stuff. Then we're gonna make the data complete. So we're gonna let Roblox decode it or encode it, uh, so Discord services can understand the coding. And then we're gonna post the. Um, the embed we're gonna post the message with the url so we're gonna post the message with our webhook and uh, we're gonna post the title and the description so that's just a quick quick explanation of how to do it so if we play the game i just got a discord message newbie or pdf newbie or pdf has joined your game so this is an absolute amazing way to do this so if you enjoyed this kind of content, just subscribe. And you can imagine a lot of things with this. You can do like like, like click detector. Make sure it has to be a script and in a service script service or workspace. Um, Cause uh, a Roblox cannot execute something from the client. It has to be executed from the server. 
so that's a uh, quick explanation. You can do a lot of things with Roblox, such as Discord, as you can see. And this is one of the easiest things you can make in, in your Discord game. Uh, to Discord game, sorry, Roblox game. It's just a quick, quick new feature. Well, this feature has been on for like long. Uh, but uh, this feature has been on for long. But if you know what you do, it's so easy. So, um, if you enjoyed this tutorial, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out and adios.